this is the real Tom Rose. We need to calculate two um, circumferences here. Uh, the circumference of the outer circle and the circumference of the inner circle. Now the diameter, to calculate a circum some circumference, you want to do uh, pi times d. Now the, the circumference of the outer circle is the diagonal of that square, right? The circumference of the inner circle, on the other hand, is the length of the square. Right, so we're basically saying we need the length of the square, which they give us is x. So actually, I'll set up the ratio now. Circumference, um, say circumference big over circumference little, is that what they're asking? Yeah, is gonna be pi times the, for the big one, it's pi times the diagonal. For the little one, it's pi times the, uh, times the width. The pi's cancel out, so we're really being asked, this, this whole question rephrases to, what's the ratio of the diagonal over the width of the square? Now we already know the diagonal of the square, or sorry, we already know the width of the square um, is x. So we really just need the diagonal, and we divide it by x, and that'll give you your answer. So how do you figure out the diagonal of a square with side x? Well, that square, which has a 90 degree angle and two 45 degree inner angles like this, that's a special 45, 45, 90 triangle, which has sides of ratio one, one, and root two. Or in this case, it'll be x, x, and root two, x, or we'll say x root two. So now we know the diagonal of the big square. The diagonal of the square is x root 2, and the width of the square is x, so the x's cancel out, and you're just left with is root 2.